Good morning and hi again everybody. So this is the third of the decks that showed up the other day. Um, this arrived the same day as the uh, the package from Chris Ann with the Muse and the Lightseer's Tarot. And this is the second edition of the Illuminated Earth Oracle by Claire Mack. Um, and I actually, I backed this one on Kickstarter. She did a, a Kickstarter to get funding for a second printing. So I have seen some of the cards online. Obviously, on the Kickstarter she had you know, pictures up. Um, but I haven't seen all of it. Oh gosh. This doesn't go really quickly. I'm going to have to pause the camera. Okay, I think I got it. There we go. So I was reading on the Kickstarter page that she, um, as she was creating this deck, she was like hand marbling the paper and um, working with that. And see, I got the page up over here on my computer so I don't forget what I wanted to say about it. Um, so it's 63 cards, hand painted and collaged. Um, so it's four and three quarters by three inches and 350 GSM matte lamination. And we've got this beautiful two-piece box here. I like when they even do the insides, so that's a nice touch. And there's just this little 24 page guidebook. Okay, so it's all alphabetical order, although they don't seem to have any numbers on them. Okay, so I did see that she was talking about these little symbols that are on the cards. Each of the cards will have one of these symbols on it. Origin, wholeness, completeness, state of being, positive association, strength, fullness, accord. And there are some, she said there are some darker cards in the deck. Negative association, conflict, absence, challenges, and intersection of matter with consciousness, human influence, and choice. So, it's the only illustration in the book, so let's get to the cards. Enough with the preliminaries. Okay, so they're not edged in any way. But they have this like matte gold line around them. I think. Yeah, the box kind of had like gold foiling on just a couple of things. So let's see if I can zoom in without killing the camera here. We have abundance. Okay, let's try it without this light and see if the camera can adjust. Is that better? that thing out of here. Accomplishment. And the little symbols that she was talking about are all up here on the top of the border. Air. Some 
combustion. Maybe a little bit more light. I just always want the colors to show up well. Decay. Excuse me for just a sec while I get a sip of tea. Oh, sorry about that. Deluge. That's beautiful. Wow. Influence. I just love the colors in this. I think that's what drew me to the deck initially. She is still selling these on Etsy even though the Kickstarter has ended. But she needed some extra money to get the deck printed, which I believe is why she went to Kickstarter with it again. I think the first edition just came out last year, so must have done pretty well, but it's expensive getting decks printed. She's only got a handful of people in the deck. This is Moon. This is beautiful. Isn't that gorgeous? Multiverse. Mystery. Ooh, that's gorgeous. Obstacle. Hmm. 
Reminds me of Tibetan prayer flags. Patience. Jewel tones are just gorgeous. I apologize for any droning plane noises. I'm close to the local municipal airport, so it's a lot of air traffic. And this is Phenomenon. It's hard to read there. That's quite lovely. Plants. Hmm. Potential. Productivity. Protection. Reflection. Reincarnation. Relationship. Release. Renewal. Resilience. I like these little points of light that she highlights. Resistance. Responsibility. Retreat. Separate. Source. Stillness. Structure. Support. Tempest.
transient. Underworld. Upheaval. Vulnerability. Water. That's lovely. I believe. Let's see, wisdom, final card. I was going to say, I believe she has prints of at least some of these available on her Etsy shop as well. Oh. That's the kind of thing. I wouldn't do a, a whole reading with it, but, you know, pull a card a day or something. Um, but, yeah, that's, that is quite beautiful. Read out what the little book says about abundance here. The view through a microscope reminds us of all that exists beyond the naked eye. Though at times we may perceive scarcity, it is only a perception. Look around and observe the proliferation of life and nature, and remember there is more than enough. Open your mind and heart to receive all that you need. Hmm. Nice. So, yeah. That is the Illuminated Oracle by Claire Mack. And I will put all the pertinent links down below. Uh, hopefully I won't forget like I did with the, <laughs> the last couple of decks I did. So thanks for watching and I wish you all a great weekend and um, I will talk to you soon. Blessed be.